Use case 5, Object Property Initialization. EV can be used to create a more encapsulated object construction pattern. Check out this real example from Angular. This pattern is pretty standard. We do some setup, in this case, setting up the tutorial files and finding out the dependencies, and then use the setup in the returned object. But there are two main issues with this pattern. Firstly, this can lead to spaghetti code very easily. I mean, just look at this function. There are only three lines of setup, yet the JSON parsing still finds its way in between the declaration and the initialization of the tutorial files. The second problem is that the setup and the property initialization, they are in two completely different places. With Ify, we can group everything related to a particular property in just one area. So yeah, with this pattern, each property becomes self-contained I'll be impressed if you manage to find ways to mix up the setup logic. They are in two different functions. How, how are you going to mix things up? Nice.